In 2017, India was the world's third largest oil importer. The demand for crude oil is increasing day by day, prompting private and government owned refineries to pursue brownfield and greenfield expansion plans to meet the growing demand and expanding refining capacity. India is emerging as a key player in the global oil market as demand rose over 10% in January 2018 up for the fourth consecutive month. 4.93 million barrels per day oil was imported in January, 13.6% higher than the December import volume. India's neighbour China is the world's largest oil importer with a growing refining capacity as well. But India is performing exceptionally well economically as compared to China. India's GDP grew 7.2% in the third quarter and the GDP is expected to grow even more this year. Whereas China grew 6.8% in the third quarter and is expected to grow at the pace for the full year. It is expected that India will soon surpass China as the fastest growing oil products market in Asia. Currently, India has 23 refineries with a capacity of 247 million metric tons per year. The state-run sector accounts for 142 million metric tons per year of current capacity and the private sector has a capacity of 88 million metric tons per year. A list of projects is lined up that will boost the production output of India. HPCL is pursuing an expansion of its Vishakapatnam refinery from 8.3 million metric tons per year to 15 million metric tons per year and is also aiming to expand its Mumbai refinery capacity from 7.5 million metric tons per year to 9.5 million metric tons per year. HPCL has also signed an agreement with the Rajasthan government to set up a refinery in Barmar which will have a capacity of 9 million metric tons per year. HPCL, Gale and Andhra Pradesh government are also setting up a petrochemical complex at Kakinada. Major market participants are expecting that India's refining capacity will grow by 300,000 barrels per day in 2018. Private players Reliance and SR Oil are also consistently working to expand their refining capacity. Meanwhile, India's ever-growing population contributes to strong downstream demand which makes a strong case for investment in oil fins. New ethylene and propylene plants are expected to be up and running by 2025. Market research suggests that ethylene demand will grow by 3.3 million tonnes by 2025. HPCL and Mithil Energy Limited HMEL, is expecting to start a mixed feed steam cracking plant at Fulkhari, Punjab by 2023 with a capacity of 1100 kilotons per annum. A Gale, HPCL joint venture at AV Nagaram, Andhra Pradesh is expected to start by 2024 with a capacity of 1000 kilotons per annum. Two more ethylene crackers by IOCL are speculated to begin by 2020. Industry players and research propose that propylene demand will grow by 2.3 million tons by 2025. HMELS Fulokari plant is expected to produce 150 kilotons per annum by FCC and 500 kilotons per annum by steam cracking. IOCL's Paradeep refinery is expected to produce 700 kilotons per annum by FCC by the end of 2018. Other crackers by IOCL, HPCL and BPCL are also under speculation. Combining the capacity of all the new plants will contribute to major output growth by the petrochemical complexes. With the synergy of growing demand and expanding capacity, India's refining industry will make it big in the petrochemical sector. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash polymer update and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at polymer update. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.